Go from the bank, Citizens Bank Park in Philadelphia. Today, a matchup of NL East rivals between the New York Mets and the Philadelphia Phillies. And now, Alongside Mark DeRosa and Dan Plesak and guys, the Mets played well in the series so far, winning the first two in this three-game set. Yeah, and to sweep this team right here would be a huge momentum boost. It is not easy to sweep a series. I don't care if it's three games or four games. I think back to Bobby Cox. His big thing was you just want to win series. Two out of three, three out of four. But when you have a chance to sweep a team, you have to take advantage of it. John Gant, a right-handed Georgia native, gets the starting nod. Dan, any thoughts? Hey, you always like to begin the season on a good note. In his first start of the year, he did just that, picking up the win. There's nothing he'd like to do more than to get number two in this one here. There's a swing and a missile sent out to center field. Center fielder looking up. Gone to lead off the inning. So it's a solo shot on the very first pitch of the ball game. Home run number five on the year, and the Mets are on the board first, one to nothing. This guy has some pop in that leadoff spot. You have to be a little bit more careful than that. Threw him a first pitch strike, and he hit it over the wall. Top of the lineup, stepping in, Gerald Hayden. He'll lead it off here to begin the second. For me, this is an important add-on inning here. Their little lead is cute. I like it, but keeping the pressure on, building that lead, that's how you bury someone. Hey, wait for your pitch up there, huh? First pitch of the A-B on its way. Swing and a miss on a pitch below the knees. One strike. Dan D. Rowe, these Phillies as they begin play here today. They dropped another one last time out, and in fact, they've won just twice in their last eight tries. Yeah, Matty, you can't win when, when you're giving up that many runs. The pitcher was missing over the heart of the plate, not executing down and away, not brushing back anybody, making anyone go, feel uncomfortable. Guys were taking huge hacks off them, and to boot, the defense was on its heels. On the first, and there's one gun here to start the second. Next up, Gerald Hayden grounded out in his last at bat. Yeah, I understand that, Matty, but this guy's got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. Swing and a drive to right. There it goes. And it's gone as they add still another. A solo shot here to straightaway right field. His second of the game as they pile on. It's now six to nothing. Well, if I was the manager, I would tell my pitchers to work around this guy. I mean, he's hit three home runs against them in this series. What more do they need to see? Four, five? Jeez, enough is enough. So the lineup flips over and digging in. Gerald oh, hey, Payton comes in two for three with a couple of home runs thus far on his line. That was a pretty good pitch too, man. That last AD when he went deep. That was a fastball that was in and off the plate. So that tells me this guy likes the ball on that inner half go of the on, plate go on, go or on. even inside off the plate. If I'm on the mound right now, I'm keeping the ball away from this guy. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. <laughs> You'd think they'd stop pitching to this guy by now. He's been torching them all weekend and he stays hot here with another extra base hit. They'll be happy when this series is over so they don't have to deal with this dude anymore. So next to bat will be Jordan Luplo. He singled earlier making him one for two to this point. Popped him up. Martin waits on it. And he's got it for the final out of the frame. So they can't make anything out of the two out double. More to come on the show Sunday baseball after this. Gerald 
Hayden stands in looking for home run number three right here as you see what he's done so far in this one. Hayden. Come on, baby. See it up. Try it. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0 and 1. Hey, like you can up there, huh? No one better. This pitch is popped up. Boom is under it. And that ends the inning. Next to hit, Alec Bohm. He could really use a knock That's here 0 for 3 in the game so far. Now a double play ball here as this is on the ground to third. The second for one. Relay to Olsen. They turn the double play and that retires the side. One hits all they get. We played eight full. It's the Mets six and the Phillies three. Wow, what a week for these guys. Talk about firing on all cylinders. Winners of an amazing seven games in a row. They say to never question the streak, and these guys aren't. They're just enjoying this ride. Six to three, the final score today. The New York Mets hosted a three run first to propel them to the win. Joey Lucchese earns his first win of the season. The John Gant permitted six earned runs.